Hello coders. In this video, I am going to explain you image classification with just drag and drop. Don't you believe? Just wait and watch. Here I have launched orange from Anaconda Navigator. So now let me click on the new project. So now before I start, you can see here I have created two folders to give the input to our machine learning algorithm and to test our machine learning algorithm. First folder that I have created that you can see cat underscore dog having two folders inside with 20 images of cats and 20 images of dogs. Same I have created test underscore images folder to test our model having four images two cat images and two dog images. Now let's get started. Here you can see image analytics widget that we have to add from these add-ons to retrieving package list. So now after that it will show you this list. So now we have to click on image analytics and OK. So now after that it will show you at the end of this widget list image analytics. So now first we require import images widgets. In that we will give our training data set. Now here you can see total we are having 40 images with two categories. You can select your data set with any number of images but it will take some time to load the images inside this import images widget. Now if you want to check then here is image viewer widget. By that you can check your data set of images. Now in the next step we require image embedding. So what this image embedding step will do? So image embedding widget works by converting it to a vector representation means vector of numbers. If you want to check your vectors of numbers then we require to take data table widget that you can see over here. Actually image embedding step converted our images into 2047 features and here you can see our target variables which is cats and dogs. Now after that let me train our model. So we required for that test and score. So first input is from image embedding. Then let here I take logistic regression. You can select any classification model from here. So now let I take neural network. Almost both are same, 97% accuracy. Also you can check your confusion matrix. That you can see over here for logistic regression and neural network. Now let me predict our test images. So again I am taking logistic regression. Second instance of logistic regression. One is already there. So now let we require first input from image embedding. Then let I take prediction widgets. So it will take the input from logistic regression. Now let we import our images from the test folder. So test images. The next step is required image embedding to convert it into vectors of numbers. Then let we perform the predictions on it. That you can see correctly predicted our categories of cats and dogs. Now you can see the probabilities for the cats and probabilities for the dogs. So in the next step let me save our model. So that you can select from here. So also you can right click and select these widgets of save model. Now that we have to take the input from this. Now you can see the step import images image embedding, logistic regression, then save your model. So now click on it and save with some name. I am giving the model 1. So I am already having. So now let I overwrite it. Our model is saved. So now let we use our saved model for the prediction. So first we have to load the model. That also you can select from here model widgets load model. Now if you click on it then we have to select our model from the computer. Then now next I take 
the prediction widgets let i give our model to the predictions now import images let i import test images for the prediction next step we have to convert it into vector of numbers by the image embedding step let i give it to the predictions so these predictions are performed by our load model that you can see over here again it's correctly predicted all the categories so this way you can save your model and load your model and also you can perform the predictions on unknown inputs like this thank you thank you for watching